Welcome back to this uh, video. This video will see standard named ACL. So we have already seen standard numbered ACL and also extended numbered ACL the last few videos. So in this one we look at standard named and it's pretty easy. Uh, since it's standard, uh, we cannot like deny any specific service or anything. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, we're just telling some IP addresses uh, not to allow accessing a, a certain network or a certain device. So that's what we are doing here. So for example, I have four, four different requirements here. So we are denying 1.1 from accessing 2.0. So we have 1.1 this PC should not access the this middle 2.0 1.2 this server should not access this 2.0 3.0 here or the entire network should not access this 2.0 and permit any meaning uh, other ones should access 2.0 like 1.3 1.4 so here we are denying uh, the entire device but uh, suppose we have more devices here then those should still access 2.0 network that's what permit any means and we have already talked about it first of all we need to identify the router closest to the destination so it's 2.0 is going to be our destination which means this middle router is going to be our router where we need to configure ACL and we need to also figure out the interface we need to apply the ACL so again interface that closest to the destination is going to be this interface G000 which is the default gateway interface for this 2.0 network and that's where we will going to uh, apply the ACL and it's going to be out uh, you should uh, already know this because it's going out from here to the 2.0 network so let's start configuring this this uh, first one is deny 1.1 from accessing 2.0 so this is our router we have already uh, determined that uh, it is a uh, it is the router that we are going to configure uh, should we verify before we configure uh, I think so so let's uh, Let's ping 1.1 uh, from 1.1. Let's see 2.1. 2.1 and it's pinging. And 1.2, let's ping 2.1. ping 192.168.2.1 and it's pinging and 3.0 192.168.2.1 and it should ping and it's pinging so everything is pinging right now nothing is blocking so we are going to block some IP addresses per this requirement so enable configure terminal so this is going to be st standard named so uh, you can remember like this standard numbered always going to start with access list only so access list uh, if it's numbered it's going to be some number from 1 to 100 uh, but if it's standard named it's always going to start with IP there is a IP in front of uh, standard or extended is going to start with IP so that's how you should remember now this is only for named again for standard numbered it's always going to start with access access list so let me write it down here standard numbered is going to be access list okay access list and then standard named 
is going to be IP. There's an IP access list. Okay, like that you can remember. Okay, for name, it's always going to start with this IP in front of access list. And for standard numbered or uh, extended numbered, it will only start with access list. There's no IP. So now let's configure this. So IP access list. Now if I put a question mark, it's going to ask me whether you want to do extended or standard. So I'm going to say standard since we are doing standard. Now if I put a question mark, we can use from 1 to 99 for standard. But since this is a, a standard named, uh, we are using, we are going to use uh, a name this time instead of number but you can also do uh, 1 to 99 you can use so uh, IP access is standard let's say Cisco okay and that's it so now we can start denying the de uh, certain IP addresses so deny IP 192.168.1.1 sorry deny host 192.168.1.1 deny host 192.168.1.2 then deny uh, it's not a host so it's uh, a complete network so we need to say deny 192.168.3.0.3.0 and then we have to provide the wildcard mask because it's a network address so 0.0.0.255 and permit any you can say permit any so I hope you notice one thing with the standard named ACL after we say IP access list and then standard we put the name here we don't need to repeat this for every statement as we deny uh, certain IP addresses we you can just start listing this like deny host 1.1 deny host 1.2 deny uh, 3.0 and then put the wildcard mask so for standard numbered or extended uh, numbered we have to repeat this uh, statement access list uh, 100 uh, or, or if it's uh, standard it's going to be access list 1 uh, deny you know one, one host 1.1 then you have to repeat uh, access list 1, deny host 1.2, access list 1, deny 192.168.3.0.0.0.255. So I have to keep on repeating that. So for this standard name, as, as long as we put this on the first line, I like this IP access is standard and put the name, whatever we choose. We can start listing this we don't need to repeat this here again and again okay so that's one advantage for this standard name ACLs and remember it's always start with IP okay for uh, named uh, standard name or extended name it's going to start with IP so now let's start verifying this uh, before that we need to uh, apply this ACL uh, on the interface so we have decided that we are going to do this uh, this interface here so exit interface g00 ip access group and then cisco right you put cisco yes cisco out okay so whichever name you choose we have to again put it here okay now we can verify it 
So we'll start with 1.1. It should not access any of these. So we'll think 2.1. And straight away you can see destination host unreachable. Uh, we'll go to 1.2 and see if that one also blocking. one dot two or one dot two and we are going to ping two dot one and you can see that it's also uh, being blocked because we have applied the ACL at this interface so it's not letting the packet go through here right uh, g000 now let's verify this Three dot uh, three dot one it is so we're going to ping two dot one and you can see it's also being denied De destination host unreachable so our ACL is working we have met these requirements successfully now let's see uh, permit any so we can check this one dot three and it should access this two dot one. ping 192.168.2.1 and it is pinging so that's what it means by permit any so let's go to 3. Dot, uh, no actually this is the entire network we are denying but let's check 1.4 ping 192.168.1.1 uh, 2.1 right dot 2.1 and we are getting the reply so that is also working so this is how we would configure standard named ACL okay it's very easy actually so I hope it helps somewhat uh, in the next video we'll see uh, extended named ACL so until then stay tuned thank you good day